twice money transfer is the fastest safest and easiest money transfer app i've ever used in china hello lovely people welcome to my youtube channel in this video i am very happy to share good news to foreigners or experts in china and the good news is you can now transfer money directly from your chinese bank card to someone outside china using wise using wise i know there's already paper which you can use but guys you should use wise just to remind you i've not been sponsored by wise i just discovered wise recently and and i won't be using paper anymore i used to use paper but after discovering wise i'll not be using paper anymore why must you use wise wise is very easy to get an account paper it takes a long time and the registration is so hard you need several documents and a long period before you can have paper in china secondly there's literally no charges when you are using wise but wait paper there's a lot of charges huge charges using paper so guys here in this tutorial i want to teach you how you can link your chinese bank card transfer money from your chinese bank card directly to someone outside china so there are several several banks that you can link uh you can link to your wise account we have bank of china uh, bank of communication CITIC, icbc internet industrial and commercial bank of communication a lot a lot about 15 banks that you can use to send money directly from your bank card to somebody outside china so the working days for wise is uh from monday to thursday except between 4 p.m and 8 p.m and uh friday to until 4 p.m yeah apart from these days these times every time you can make transactions so first of all we start with bank of china if you have bank of china first of all bank of china first of all you have to first of all you have to have you have to have your what bank of china app the mobile banking app you need to have that you need to have your mobile banking app so once you have your mobile banking app you just have to open the app but the restriction with wise is you you can only send a minimum a minimum of fifty thousand that is a huge sum of money that is a huge sum, sum of money yeah so uh fifty thousand is minimum for bank of china that is for bank of china so when you open your app you just come top top left corner this side you just click on it then from there you need to just copy the recipient detail from wise page yeah you just fill the person's detail the name the accounts the amount then from there you will follow suit so the currency you have to enter the amount you have to enter should be in un cny rmb after entering the amount you enter the recipient name so you enter the correct name the person is using on Y. so for example john smith then you enter that you enter the name then after that enter the recipient account number so you have to make sure that you enter the correct account number then from there straight away you choose the recipient bank so you have to make sure that you know the recipient bank yeah i know uh these apps are in chinese so if you're not good at chinese you can just follow that you can just follow this tutorial and to be very easy follow from here then enter the bank then you have to after selecting the bank you have to search for the branch then the branch make sure that you get the correct branch you get the correct branch so there are several errors that you might encounter with bank of china the minimum amount you have to send is fifty thousand rb and i know it's a lot it's a little bit huge so with bank of china if you can't send less than fifty thousand so this is where you might face a challenge with other banks this 500 rmb 
minimum some 1000 and all those things. we'll go through that so from there you are there to go you can send money using bank of china one another bank is icbc icbc the good news is the minimum amount is 5000 rmb and the maximum amount is 10000 rmb per day and the maximum amount per month is 50000 rmb so with icbc is very good at least 500 rmb so if you don't have icbc account this is a time for you to get icbc bank account yeah so it's the same procedure you can just follow you can just follow suit like this you can just follow suit with icbc the next bank uh is china merchant bank cmb and that too you can just follow suit just like this from this pdf and you are there to go they are all almost the same they are all almost the same the next bank that you can send is china construction bank and this one too you just have to follow this procedure the the, the procedure with the bank of china is almost the same there's no difference there's no difference then uh there you go so the only challenge you'll be facing when transferring is you need to know the minimum amount you can send and the maximum amount so that is the only challenge that is the only challenge apart from that it's very easy to use or uh, wise to transfer money directly from your bank card to somebody outside china so wise is the best that i recommend for everyone I just discovered wise recently and i was like oh my god i can't believe <laughs> this app is here wow so guys try to get your account and in the description below i'll send a link of uh, the wise account how to create the wise account and subscribe to my channel for more videos coming thank you very much bye bye